We've all been there, stepped on the scale, looked at the numbers, and not like what we've seen. That's when many people make the promise to lose weight quickly. But that may not be the best approach. And here to give us some advice on this is exercise specialist Ty Timms. Thanks for joining us, Ty. Sure. We talked about people wanting to lose weight fast. Is that a realistic expectation? Uh, losing weight fast can happen. It's not the healthiest way to do it. It's not the recommended way to be losing weight. What you typically want to do with a good weight loss program is set your goals for uh, long term. And you want to set yourself up so that uh, your diet and your exercise both help each other so that you can get towards your goal. And what they recommend typically is about a pound or two a week. You need to incorporate several different things. You need to incorporate your strength training, uh, your resistance work, and also the cardiovascular work, which you can do on you know, a treadmill. You can do running outside. You can do swimming. You can do um, a lot of different things that are cardiovascular in nature. And along with that, some of the strength exercises, which will enhance the metabolic effect of your body to burn those calories even more efficiently. So strength exercises such as uh, lunges that, that you can do to strengthen your legs, very good exercises, uh, squats that you can do at home or at the gym. Uh, the gym is an excellent place to go to get both of these facets in to your program. Now I know one of the things, and you've said this, but consistency really is the key. What if you can't get a 30 minutes of high intensive aerobics in? Um, is there another way to get that aerobic exercise? Sure, the cardiovascular system, what, what you need to do is raise your heart rate. When your heart rate elevates, then it's burning more calories. You can do 10 minutes in the morning, 10 in the afternoon, 10 at night. It can be a walking program. Actually, the lower that you keep it in that target heart rate zone, your, your heart rate, it's going to be burning the fat. If you keep it up at high intensity too, too much, it's going to be burning more of carbohydrates, and which will also burn calories in turn, but um, what you need to do is think about your conditioning level. You know, if you're starting a program, you want to start slow, you want to keep it low intensity, and the longer you keep your heart rate at that low level of target heart rate, the better you're going to be in attaining your goals. And the best advice, just get out and move. That's right. And we'll be back next month with more Look Good, Feel Great.